So this is a trick that I've been doing for a long time and I noticed um, Stephen West does this. But rather than weaving in when you have a, t a ton of um, ends to weave in, which can be annoying, there is a method that I use to, if I'm adding new yarn, um, which switching yarns, I start with my new yarn, and it's best to do this on a knit row if you can, and then I take the tail of the old yarn and loop it over and then go back to the new yarn and then I knit one stitch I um, so I knit one where I loop the yarn over and now I'm going to take the old yarn from the right to the left new yarn from left to right and old yarn back over oops and then you knit the next stitch. You can't do this every stitch because the yarn can just pull right out. And so it's from the right to the left, left to right, and then over, back over, and then knit again. So I'll show this again. Okay, so I'm doing this again. New yarn comes on. I knit that and then take the old yarn and come over from the right to the left and the new yarn from left to right and old yarn from left to right. And can you see how it's catching that? So you have to do it every other stitch, not every stitch. So right to left, left to right, right to left. And you can see along the back how it's being woven in as you go. Awesome. And it's, I find, if I remember to do it, um, it makes my life a whole lot easier. But you know